When Kathy and Paul Rosenblum married over 30 years ago, she was Catholic and he was Jewish. Her devotion to the faith made an impact, however, and in the early 1990s, Paul started to attend Mass with his wife on a regular basis. But something eventually started working, and I decided that it was the right thing to explore a little bit more, and then I went through the RCIA program in 1996. In 2001, they moved to Charleston, and he started a job at the Citadel. It was then that he had his first thoughts about becoming a deacon. A few years later, Kathy pointed out the diaconate formation classes in the church bulletin. So she's the one that called attention to it. So somehow she knew that something was going on. Uh, she seems to know that all the time. Paul started the application process in 2010, and this past Friday he was ordained a permanent deacon by Bishop Robert E. Guglielmoni at St. Mary's Church in Charleston. My dear brother, before you enter the order of the diaconate, you must, you must declare before the people your intention to undertake this office. So I ask you, do you resolve to be consecrated for the church's ministry by the laying on of my hands and the gift of the Holy Spirit? I do. Do you resolve to discharge the office of deacon with humble charity in order to assist the priestly order and to benefit the Christian people? I do. My dear people, let us pray that God, the all-powerful Father, will mercifully pour out the grace of his blessing on this his servant, whom in his kindness he raises to the sacred order of the diaconate. Deacon Paul will serve at St. Mary's Church and will also have duties with the port ministry. I've been involved in the, uh, the Charleston Port and Seafarer Society for almost eight, almost ten years now. And so I will be also be kind of a representative of the church and the apostleship of the sea, which is the, the Catholic Church's ministry to the to seafarers. So that will be part of my duties as well. Kathy said that her husband has always been motivated to learn about the church and is a very faithful man. As the wife of a deacon, she plays an important role in supporting his ministry. I'm very proud of him and uh, he worked hard and uh, I think he will make an excellent deacon.